One in five of us will experience a mental health condition at some point in our lives. Joining us now is Jamie Angelini. She's the director of special projects for the Mental Health Association in New Jersey. Jamie, you have so many training programs for people to recognize mental health conditions, either in themselves or others. Tell us about that. Absolutely. So we call them gatekeeper programs or gatekeeper trainings. Um, the first one that I will briefly talk about is mental health first aid, and that is an evidence-based public education program. It's a full day training, but it really allows participants to get a better understanding of what a mental health challenge is, how it impacts individuals, um, and importantly, early intervention, how we reach out early for someone in our life, how we encourage them to reach out for support, and it reduces stigma and increases mental health literacy. Um, it's a certification program. I just, it's a wonderful program. I think everyone in the community should have it. A great training. I took it myself and I just thought it was so valuable and you have it virtually or in person. Uh, and tell us about your QPR program. Yeah, so QPR is Question, Persuade, Refer. It is a suicide prevention training um, that's offered in 90 minutes. And again, it allows the lay person to understand early warning signs, risk factors of suicide, and also have the courage and the tools to ask someone in their life if they're thinking about suicide. It allows us to intervene and, and to save lives. And again, these trainings are trainings that anybody can take in our community to be able to support other people in their life. Just like CPR training for our physical health, these types of trainings are for our mental health. And the programs are either tailored to teens or to adults, something that we all should do. So Jamie, where can we learn more about getting one of these trainings? on our website at mhanj.org. Thank you so much for joining us. Jamie Angelini, Director of Special Projects for the Mental Health Association in New Jersey. And thank you for joining me today for Living Well with Robin Stoloff. Jamie and I dive much more into this topic on my podcast, Living Well with Robin Stoloff. Listen wherever you get your podcasts, or if you'd like to watch the video of our conversation, you can always go to my YouTube channel or my website. Thanks so much for being with me today for Living Well with Robin Stoloff, empowering you to live a healthier life. See you next time.